Main article. Coruscant Underworld. What about Coruscant? Is there unrest here? You must be joking. Go down 2,000 levels and you'll find all the unrest you could ever want. Go down 4,000 and you might as well be in wild space. Mitathra Naruodo and Wolf Ularan beneath the top-level structures, streets and glistening lights of the city surface was Coruscant's underworld. Its underworld was known for its crime and smugglers. It was accessible by huge portals that additionally served as ventilation shafts. The underworld was a massive city beneath a city with hundreds of levels built on top of each other. On each level, dwellings and smaller buildings were squeezed in between massive towers and infrastructure that serviced the upper levels. The streets and alleyways were narrow and large sections contained massive buildings and warehouses, largely abandoned. Sunlight almost never reached the lower levels, which had to be artificially lit. The population was able to move from one area to another via trains that ran below and above the planet's surface. While airspeeders were used, they were a less common sight than on the surface levels. The underworld, containing a vast population of the poor and criminal, was dark and violent. Those who wanted to disappear to hide from the authorities or to conduct illegal transactions could blend in despite the presence of cam droids and other monitoring technology. Patrolled by the Underworld Police Division of the Coruscant Security Force, the Underworld was where large populations of species not loyal to the Emperor were relocated to after the formation of the Empire. Uprisings and riots became common, with stormtroopers frequently called in to assist the Coruscant cops in putting down any dissent with ruthless violence. 